to. Yeah, yeah. 13 going on 30. Yep. Friday at the next. Yep. Uh -huh. The interpreter. Guilty. I ain't like none of them movies. Mm -hmm. You having a check. Wait, 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 Cavity wait, wait, wait. check. Oh, hey, wait, 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 wait. This, will this help with that, with that? Now, I like that kind of movie. <laughs> Go on through, baby. All right. <laughs> From the suburbs of Iran, Monster Brony. I'm the Iranian of the group. I'm the Iranian. That's what we chant at soccer games. Um, so, yeah, I'm the Iranian. It's funny because people, I tell them, my American friends, I go, yeah, I'm Iranian. They go, oh, so you're Arab. And I'm like, no, we're actually different. We're not Arab. But, you know, I mean, we're similar. You know, we're all getting shot at. You know, that's one thing. <laughs> But, you know, but Iranians are actually, ethnically, we're actually, you know, we're, we're Aryan. We're, we're white. We're white, so stop shooting. You know, that's what I'm trying to... And, and then my American friends go, well, how can we tell you apart? How can we? And I go, well, it's in the accent. It's in the accent. Iranians, when Iranians speak, they talk a lot of slow. Ed. Iranians talk like this. Iranians talk like this. We talk very slow. Like, you know, maybe we just shot some heroin. We're falling asleep. How are you? How are you? I am Iranian. How are you? How are you? It's Iranian. Okie dokie. It's Iranian. Take it easy. Don't worry about it. I'm Iranian. And Arab, Arab talk a lot faster. Arab talk faster. Arab talk a lot faster. Arab talk like the just some cocaine. They're talking. How are you? I'm How are you? How are you? How are you? How are you? But no, we are very similar now, man. We are. I know you guys get like, I get like stupid questions. I know you do too. Like, like people think just because I'm from the Middle East, I'm an expert on the Middle East. So like, I got a friend, like anytime the gas prices go up, he'll always ask my opinion about it. He'll always corner me. Hey, Maz, hey, Maz, um, in your opinion, what's going on with this gas thing? What is, what's going to happen? What's going on? 50 words or less. Break it down, would you? You're my Middle Eastern friend. Uh, I'm like, dude, I don't, I don't work at OPEC. I don't know. I, I pay the same price as you, you know? Like, I don't have, like, a discount pump at the gas station. You know, I don't walk in like, Hassan Hossein, discount pump? Oh, trade my friend, fantastic. Yeah. You know, it's funny, because I actually, I do get those questions, and I did that joke one night at a show, and another friend of mine was at the show, and then he emailed me the next day. He was joking with me, emailed me on my Hotmail. He said, hey, Maz, had a great time last night at the show. By the way, when's the next Terrasic going down? Ha ha. So I got on my Hotmail, and I was like, well, I'm not being flagged. I can respond, right? So I was like, hey, man, I've been talking to Al-Qaeda, and um, the next terrorist hit is going down the Lower East Side of Iceland. Ha ha. Send. Yeah, next day, tried to log on to Hotmail. Account closed. Access denied. I was like, oh, my God, I got flagged. I got flagged. I was freaking out, and I tried to contact Hotmail, you know, to tell him I'm a comic. I'm a co I put ha ha. I put ha ha. Ha-ha, right? Al-Qaeda doesn't send emails and American pigs must die. Ha-ha, they don't do that. They don't like forward emails, you know, Mustafa, you're gonna love this one. LOL, laugh out loud. They don't do that. And I tried to contact Hotmail, but they don't have a phone number. Go home, try and look it up. There's no phone number for Hotmail. So I had to find, I found out who owned them, Microsoft Network. I called them up. I said, hello, Microsoft. You know, um, I'm having some problems. I'm a comic. And I tried to explain. They go, well, we can't help you out, but we'll put you through to someone who can. And I swear, I think they passed me through to Iraq, I think. Because, you know, because it used to be, you know, they would send you to India for tech support, you know. But I think Iraq is cheaper now, I swear to God. Because, no, because, like, you know, I know the accent, you know, if it were India, I'd be like, hello, what is going on? You're having trouble with your hotmail, let's take care of it, you know. But it wasn't, it was an Arabic accent, like, what is going on? And I think it was Iraq, because she was in a rush to get me off the phone, like there was a war going on in the background. And I swear, she was like, what, you're having trouble with your hotmail? There's a war going on here. <laughs> Just because you put ha-ha doesn't make it funny. <laughs> All right, you're heckling me from Iraq. What's up? <laughs> no, but then, and then it took me weeks. It says send emails. I had to send emails back and forth. Weeks, weeks, weeks. Finally, I'm on the Internet. I'm so happy I'm back. But I'm freaked out on the Internet. You guys should be too. Don't joke on the Internet, okay? Like, I'm on that MySpace now, and you can go and, you know, join my MySpace. You know, myspace.com slash Maz Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, add me as a friend. We can be friends, but don't send me an email going like, hey, Moz, when's the next terrorist hit going down? Because I'll respond, F you, I'm a patriot. <laughs> <laughs> You're looking for Ahmed Ahmed. 
<laughs> and here's my thing too, people are cool, man. People are cool, politicians mess it up. Politicians put us all against each other, man. I don't like any of them, ours, theirs, none of them. Yeah, like Bush, I can't believe he's the president. Even if you voted for him, you gotta admit, you gotta admit, every time he's on TV, he just doesn't look presidential. He does, every time Bush is on TV, I'm watching, I'm like, he's not the president. Someone's pulling our legs, someone's messing with us. Every time I see Bush on TV, I'm waiting for Ashton Kutcher to run out. Be like, you've all been punked. What? Osama comes running out of a cave. He's like, I was in on it too. What? Makes sense. Iran, politicians of Iran are talking to America. Why, why would you talk to America? America has recently bombed your neighbors. America has bombed Iraq and Afghanistan. Iran is in the middle. It's a good time to be quiet. Right? It's like, it's like being at a nightclub and the bouncer is knocked out your friends and you're still talking shit, right? Come on. <laughs> I'll tell you why Iran is talking shit. There's a lot of opium usage in Iran. Yes, the politicians are high. You have to be high to talk shit to America. Because opium is supposed to mellow you out, but I think it also makes you delusional. I do. I think they're getting high and they're going, hey, you know what we should do? Let's call America. <laughs> give me the phone, give me the phone, give me the phone, give me the phone. Give me the phone. Let me talk, let me talk, let me, I feel good, let me talk, let me talk. Let me talk. Hello, America. <laughs> you. <laughs> Bring it on, bitch. We kick your ass. And then they hang up and they go, hey guys, do we have a military? Oh, we don't, oh, America, just kidding. <laughs> I am Persian, meow. <laughs> the next day, the president of Iran's like, did I drunk dial Bush again last night? <laughs> oh, stop drunk dialing Bush. <laughs> That's the beauty of this country, guys. We can have these debates, we can talk about this, and we should be critical of government, of politicians, you should be, and that's the beauty of this country. And that's why we have to have these open debates. Like, I couldn't be making fun of the president of Iran in Iran, right? You'd be like, hey, Maz, that was a good show. When's your next show? I'd be like, there are no more shows. <laughs> Real quickly, I'm gonna leave you with this. Please, I always say this, please, stop blaming Middle Easterners for everything, okay? And I always say, it's not always us, right? It is not always us, okay? I mean, quite often it is, but not always. <laughs> we get blamed for everything. Whatever happened, like there was a blackout in New York a few years ago, the news came on, they're like, there's been a blackout, terrorists might have been involved. And then a week later, they're like, oops, sorry, just Enron, right? <laughs> like there's, there's a traffic jam on the five, terrorists might be involved. Oops, sorry, just cars, you know? It's like, and it started with the anthrax. Remember the anthrax they tried to blame on us? I knew that wasn't a Middle Easterner. That's not how the Middle Easterners work. Right? Middle Eastern be like, what? Do you want me to put the anthrax in the envelope, put the stamp on the envelope and mail it? No, 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 no. That is not how I do it. No, no. Can I wrap the anthrax around myself and run into somebody? That is how I do it. You know, one, two, bang, like that. You know what I'm saying? I can get two people. One, two, that's it. Anymore, I hurt my back. One, two, ow, it hurts. I've been in a cave for six years with Osama. I'm old. We all know who did the anthrax. It was some hillbilly dude. You know some redneck was like, right about now is a good time to send out some anthrax. Blame the goddamn Arabs, that's what I'll do. Blame them goddamn kebab-eating, Mercedes-Benz driving, camel riding, 7-Eleven owning, surfy selling, gas price raising, unibrow connected, hairy chested mother <laughs> Right? Right? You know it was, and they have not caught him yet. I hope they catch that guy eventually, because that'll make everyone realize we got haters of all kinds, you guys. White, black, Asian, Middle Eastern, Latin, all kinds of haters. And what we have to do as a people is counter the hate with some love, right? Yes. Spread the love, man. Right? I mean, they were going around, they were putting anthrax in the mail, they were putting anthrax in the water. Hey, man, you want to put something in my water? Put some ecstasy in my water. That's the kind of terrorist I'm looking for. Right? I drink the water, I'm like this. <laughs>